Hello everyone, um, this is just Paul and Andy um, from Ashburnham Place. Sorry it's been a while since our last video. Um, we just wanted to give you some quick updates um, on what's going on here, our thinking for the future. Um, you'll see, as you, if you haven't had the, the opportunity to be here, but summer has truly come and our wildflower meadow is springing to life, the goslings are wobbling around. Yeah, so life continues as normal at Ashburnham Place, but it's a lot quieter than it has been. Hmm. And as you know, we're, we are in a real transition point, trying to deal with the impacts of COVID-19 on the charity. So we have 36 of our staff team away on furlough, only six, a small skeleton team of six staff. Sadly, we've had to send home 75% of the international volunteers, which is really heartbreaking for us. Um, and Paul and I have been spending most of our time between this sort of juxtaposition of trying to deal with the the very real impact on the charity of going from roughly speaking £200,000 of income every month to nothing overnight and all of the impacts that that brings. And on the other side, wrestling with these bigger questions of the future of Ashburn and Christian Trust. What is the Trinity saying to us about where we go from here and what can we do from here and how, what does that look like? So we've been trying to wrestle with those two, two very real realities and just trying to listen to the voice of the Holy Spirit in the midst of that. So that's been interesting, hasn't it? Yeah. Yes. And, and, and right now we're, we're exploring ways of being able to welcome some of you back. Um, we think from July the government are lifting some of the restrictions so it may be possible um, with certain conditions that some of you will be able to come back even if it's just to have a cup of tea in the orangery. So we're working on that over the coming weeks and we'll update you as and when we have a, a, a definite plan. We, we also wanted just to thank so many of you have been in touch, have written letters, have called us, have emailed, have sent money just to support us through the time and we are massively grateful for all the kindness and support that we've received. Um, and actually it, it has made the world of a difference, particularly the financial giving has really made a huge difference to our ability to survive through this time. Um, it, we still obviously have that need if you're able and, and feeling the need to give, feel free to. There'll be a link somewhere around this post, but um, our Just Giving page is still up and running, so feel free to give if you can. And we just wanted to leave you guys with a real encouragement that we know that we follow a God in Jesus Christ who sees the reality in all of us and sees the stuff to work on in all of us, but also primarily sees the possibility in each of us. So no, no matter how you're feeling at the moment, know that Jesus Christ sees the possibility in you. He sees the possibility in Ashburn and Christian Trust for the future. And please join us in prayer as we stand together um, in prayer for all that God wants this place to be. And we're praying for you at this moment in time because we know it's a really difficult, difficult time for everybody. So you're in our prayers. Please pray for us. Thank you for listening and goodbye. Cheerio.